I'm excited about this team. Two weeks from yesterday, we kick off um, against a very, very good Michigan State team. Um, three weeks from today, the home opener against uh, New Mexico State. When Aggie basketball is alive and well and winning, okay, it does wonders just like football does, not only for the whole university, but for our community. I think that's one of the coolest things about Utah State and Cache Valley is the tight-knit community and everything that is intertwined in terms of the city of Logan, Cache Valley, Utah State, Utah State Athletics. And so a winning football team and a winning basketball team to me go hand in hand. It's all intertwined in this community and it's special. And Utah State, Cache Valley, um, our program, I think sticks with people as they move on in life. And as they look back and reflect of what their time at Utah State meant to them, I think it's really special. And we got to share that a little bit with our guys last night. That Aggie family feeling is so strong right now. It is strong in this valley. It is strong across the state. It is strong across the region and across uh, the world. It really is a time when people are proud to be part of Utah State Universities. It's one of our highest numbers on the Logan campus that we've ever had, and one of the highest numbers we've had across the whole USU system. They're uh, doing their best on the field, the court, the track, wherever we're asking them to perform competitively. And as we are often quick to tell you, they're successful in the classroom as well. And that dual emphasis matters so much to all of us. I feel very confident that the almost 400 student athletes that we have representing us across 16 sports, the coaching staffs that we have, the support that we have both within athletics administration and university administration has us poised for maybe the best year ever of Utah State Athletics. I know coming off last year, our average GPA for all of our student athletes for the fall 2017 and spring 2018 semesters, 3.25, the highest it's ever been. There's a direct correlation in collegiate athletics between investment in and success output. For us to continue to ascend in terms of success, we've got to continue investing more and more dollars. And as I look across the room here, there are a lot of people who invest their time and resources in Aggie Athletics, and we're very appreciative of that. Whether we will not lose sight of our everyday blue collar fan in Cash Valley, because you all are extremely, extremely important to us. I'm so proud of being your men's basketball coach and being the, the coach at Utah State. It's been a fantastic summer. We're allowed to work our guys out for eight weeks over the summertime. And uh, obviously, you know, transition's always difficult. There's different styles of play, different philosophies, a new language. I go on and on and on. Um, and so, but I, I, I really, I felt like we got better over those eight weeks. And you know, we're gonna be a super young team. We only have four guys on our team that have really have Division One playing experience. But thank you guys for everything that you do. We can't wait to get this the Spectre Magic uh, back and rolling. We had a bunch of season ticket holders this morning coming up and you know picking out their seats and where they want to sit. And then, of course they told me hey, sit over uh, behind the opponents you know, bench. That's always a great spot. Just give them the business the whole the whole uh, forty minutes. So. To have you all out today. We we appreciate your investment. And Utah State Athletics, again, looking forward to a tremendous year.